missed again. What a player this boy is, he's got another! I loved the way he would just make fun of other players, whether he was nutmegging them or going round, you know, Chopper Harris. It was a delight to watch. He was the great entertainer. I got a bit annoyed because he only ever showed the end of it. <laughs> I had to do a little bit of work before I stuck in the back of the net, actually nutmeg the defender. And then, of course, the keeper came out. It was like time stood still just before I rolled it in. The more I read and the more I met people, family related, footballers, what have you, the more fascinating I found his background. It was natural to think, I suppose, well, this could be a fascinating movie. What we want to do is show George where he came from and how he became this sort of extraordinary footballer and then to track him through from that period growing up in Belfast going to Manchester United we're talking about a football genius so we want to try and understand how how does it happen why did you get someone like that here comes best again what a player this boy is he's got another is it just a quirk of you know why do we get a Shakespeare why is it a quirk of genes and fate and hazard um, and then also to show why he was so special that he had this extraordinary gifts, but also the sense of humor, the love of life, um, and you might say a fatal weakness for the alcohol, but he would say he brought upon himself. It's basically a story of a fascinating life by an amazing uh, person. I know that at the end of it all, the people remember me first and foremost for what I could do on the field. People still say to me, oh, I remember that day. And uh, hopefully they'll, they'll always remember the football side of it and, and why the crowds came. I think it's fantastic. I think it's going to be... Nobody's ever made a film about a footballer. There's been Seve Ballas, tennis and golf, American footballers, a million f films made. Nobody's made one about a soccer player. You make one about a soccer player, particularly everybody in America knows him because he played there. And everybody, Pelly said he was the best player ever. It's not a bad recommendation, is it? What's great about the crowdfunding thing is that if you're a fan, if, you're a, if you love George, you'll be able to get close to him in the way that we're recreating his life. So whether it's in Belfast, you know, trying to do Belfast in the 60s or the latter days, you'll get that insight and there'll be people there, well everyone I think, who's a great George Best fan. So if you want to live in the sort of shadows or relive some of those best moments, this is a great way to get close to it. Unbelievable player, the best player I've played against, certainly in this country without a doubt. So, I mean, it'd be interesting to see uh, what sort of film they can make about him. I hope it's a success. I mean, people around the world, football and sport around the world, would be interested to see him. So, it, it makes it worthwhile, you know. He just had this ability which, you know, you have to just call genius. This is best. Wriggling out space. What a fight, Sam! What a fight, John! Georgie Best! He has! Best again! A glorious goal by Best! What a magnificent 